Okay, so with this here, double brackets, right, we're going to um, FOIL again, okay, and um, we simply start off here then with 5 times 5, which is um, 25, okay, um, and then we do the outers, okay, now in this case, it's a little bit more complex than last time, isn't it, because we've got 5 times 3 root 2, that's what's going on there, isn't it, okay, 5 times 3 root 2, and you just got to put the big numbers together, right? And leave the root 2 as it is. So 5 times 3 is 15, isn't it? So that'll be 15 root 2. When you do the inners then, 5 times 3 root 2 again, right? Or 3 root 2 times 5, that's what it is, isn't it? So if you just do the 5 times 3 is 15. So, and it'd be minus one at this time, because there's a minus f, minus 15 uh, root 2. And then the last, now the last is going to cause us some problems, right? The last are going to cause us some problems. Let me write it down. I'm going to do 3 root 2. Right, I'll write it down here. I've got some room down here. 3 root 2 times 3 root 2. Right, that's what we're going to do here, isn't it? A minus times a plus. Well, it'll make it a minus, won't it? But you've got to do this. Now, what I end up doing is, right, breaking it down. I take my time on it. I, I first of all do the big numbers. 3 times 3 is 9. Right, so do this in stages. 3 times 3 is 9. And then do the roots. Root 2 times root 2, of course, is 2, isn't it? Root 2 times root 2 is 2. So you're going to times them together and you get 18, right? So we're going to put 18 there. And then when it comes to simplifying, well, they will cancel again. One day you end up with 7 as our answer.